kind of cringing. Oh, that's funny, dude. I Krat, Krat, Krat said this was a pretty good game, so we'll see. We'll see how it goes, man. But yeah, I appreciate the lurk, man. If you do come back, man, I, it would be nice. I appreciate you, know, regardless, dude. Thank you for hanging out for The Walking Dead. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you enjoyed the, the episode. I'm going to upload it to uh, YouTube, and then I'll be letting everybody know when the fun, when the finale finale is, is going on. So. Oh, look at that. We got... Oh, dude, I like that they put the streamer mode on here, dude. That's so cool. I'll stay a bit and see what's up. If I cringe, I'll leave an alert. <laughs> it sounds good, George. Right, well, this one... Okay, so again, I, I would love it if you guys... If whoever's watching, George, if you're just the only one here, that's great, too. Um, to actually help me make these decisions a little bit, too. Uh, I think I think it would be... It makes it more fun for me if you guys help out as well. Um, I, I mean, I'll have fun regardless, but it's it's nice to have other people's input. So I, this 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 five dates one I know is like the murder mystery one where it's people on like Zoom or whatever, or like the little individual screens. But then the sequel, Ten Dates, is an actual like production where you go to like it's like real people in a real set setting, like at a diner, and you're actually going through like the talking and all those different choices and things like that so it should be it should be should be interesting he said i'm not gonna waste your time george so we'll go ahead and get started let me just uh let me start recording this, and let's try to get a girlfriend. Yeah, we got streamer mode on, display mode, borderless. Like everything is good, right? Everything looks good on, on there. Yeah. All right, let's go. Krat, Krat said this was an interesting game, so I, I take his word word. Word for it. Oh, what? The name is Vinny, dude. Let's go, dude. 27. Bro, how is this game? Per this game is already perfect for me. 5-9. Location from London. Daters is here to facilitate your digital dates. Alright, profile picture. Uh, oh, okay. So, I think from what I think we're either gonna have to go with the dog. I think the dog one is the best one. This one is also a really good one. This one, this one, or this one. But I think in I'm thinking the dog one is probably gonna be the best. That's that's gonna get the most most reactions, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Industry, many people believe a huge amount about who you are comes from your career choice. Finance, creative, education, healthcare, other. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to go creative here, because that's literally what I do. Uh, interest to give people a full flavor of who you are. It could be the perfect opening gambit for those crucial icebreakers. Okay. Uh, so we have three interests that we can pick. Um, I'm gonna do arts and culture. Wait, music. And we got one more. Spirituality is actually low key what I what I would be into. Travel to parting not as much anymore, but it definitely was a good time. Fitness, sports. I'm gonna say. Let's see, we did we did arts, arts, music, arts and culture, music, and charity. Charity could be interesting. Or just have fun with it. A little bit of partying. I do like partying though. Or I did. Bloody spirituality. That's a star sign. I'm a Virgo. Thank you, Vinny. Your profile is complete. We will present you with the video date options uh, imminently. All set up.
Have you actually just woken up? <sighs> yeah. What's the issue, man? Well, nothing. I just never understood how you could sleep until lunchtime. Lunchtime? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Ferno Life has got my body clock battered, bruv. Fair play for keeping bruv. routine in lockdown, man. Fair play. I mean, listen, I've always worked my own hours, so nothing's really changed. Yeah, cool story. Uh, is this why you woke me up? No, it isn't. I actually have a surprise for you. Oh. Is that really KSI? Go. That's not KSI, is it? It's not really KSI, is it, dude? No way. There's no way. <laughs> I don't think that's KSI. Hey, this is huge, bro. What's up, crap? Yeah, yeah, just in time. Just in time, brother. <laughs> I was all alone in the flat with nothing else to do, and I just thought, why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? You know what? I'm hearing that digital Let me grab my, is popping off during grab my Uncrustables right now, dude. Yeah. No, I literally just joined. Shout like, out Uncrustables. Hey, Vin, seriously, yeah? No joke. Your profile needs to be on point, yeah? And then when you're looking at these girls' profiles, <laughs> there's a few things you need to watch out for. You need to look at the uh, angles that they're using to get right. the pictures and that, yeah? Because they're, they're going to deceive you. Callum, I have, I have talked to girls before. I do understand what you're doing. I have talked to girls before. Okay. Give Wait, me one. On, the on, mic on, sharing on, is caring. Uh, no way. If you were to get someone that liked us, like someone already oh, like someone digs us already. Let's go, dude. Oh, you sexy bastard, bro. Sexy yes. bastard, bro. Yes, dude. <laughs> I've got some matches. Alright, man. Let me know how it goes, bro. Peace. Alright, cool, man. Bye, bye, bye. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, this would be interesting. Mm -hmm. So what we. Jesus Christ, that's loud. You are currently limited to three video dates per week. Uh, we could update. Okay, so we got Maya, Grace, Maya, Grace, Saffron, Sh uh, Shina. Who has a kid? You have a kid? <sighs> nah, I'm sorry, dude. I can't date someone that has a kid right now. You know, like, I, had, I, I can't. I'm not financially set for that, bro. <laughs> can't do it, dude. All right, so this chick, page 25, 5, 9, other sports, travel, and fitness. Um, let me move over chatty really quick. Okay. Um, Maya, 22, 5, 4, education, arts, culture, partying, and music. So far, she's the one that, like, seems the most close to us. Um, travel, food, drink, and music. She's a cancer, 27, other industry. I don't like that it's other, dude. Why can't you just tell me what you do? Saffron is a 24-5-7 creative spirituality, arts and culture, charity, and Virgo. I think if we were to go with a Virgo person, as a Virgo person, we would probably butt heads like mad. Uh, let's talk to Maya first. Um, then I'm thinking Cancer might be good. Leo might be good. We'll try we'll talk to Grace. Saffron, it, this could be an interesting conversation. And she is a creative, too. This could be an interesting conversation, too. Thank you for your selections. We will inform you if the video dates have been accepted and scheduled. Okay. Congratulations. Oh, we're three for three? The baby in, her, in the picture wasn't hers. Oh, spoilers. Crap, damn, dude. But you know what? Hold on. That's a terrible profile picture for uh, someone to have because that's the initial thing that people are going to think or a lot of people are going to be like is this this girl has a kid uh, swipe the left or whatever or that guy has a kid so, yeah, swipe left or swipe right swipe right so um I, i'm just being i'm being real you know what i mean i'm just being real oh this guy's looking peng, bro. The Tasty. I've got the fuck three does peng mean? scheduled back to back. Okay, show off. No, no, no. I like that me. this is a I've London a in, in Londonese. Uh, just treat it like a real life date, I guess. You know, people seem to be really enjoying them as well. Okay, and is this a good setup? I've got this right. Uh, you know what? I don't think you should have the bed in the back like that, man. It sends out the wrong message. Okay, I'm definitely moving into the living room. Okay. Oh, trying to look like a slut. Ugh. Oh, I like this guy. Attention. I want to date this guy. I we've spoken about this. It's, it's, it's just wrong, man. It's wrong. <laughs> now, you want to I do like how the, the name is Vinny. Light is hitting your it face. makes it feel more it's immersive. Like it's hitting mine and making me look so goddamn beautiful. 
And also what you want is eye level. Set the camera to eye level, bro. Not low angle or high angle. They are not flattering. Okay, uh, I think this is... This is good. Good spot. Uh, let's get that fireplace uh, looking nice in the back. Okay, maybe have a couple I got, more things. I got the album in the back, which is good. I really am so handsome. Oh, yeah. Okay, I got like, a trophy from when I was a kid. Ah, yeah. Show it that you're a winner. Yeah, you're a big, big winner. Eiffel 60, or Eiffel 65. <laughs> There'll be travel, maybe. We got, we, we got pens, so okay. we write. We're, we, we know how we're, we're, okay, think, we're literate. Uh, That's we're good. Ready. Oh, should I drink? Get a water. This is your call entirely, mate. Oh, the worst thing, though, is if you're drinking and the other person isn't. I'm so nervous. Okay. Um, so if we grab the booze, there's the one girl that was a partier. But like he said, if you're drinking and the other person's not drinking, and that's a big, that could be a big red flag for the other person. But if the other person's drinking and I'm not drinking, I could always be like, oh, I can go get a drink. And if the conversation is like, oh, you want to get a drink while we're on call? Why don't we just go grab a drink kind of a thing? I don't know, man. I'm not, I'm not, I'm going to go no booze. I'm going to go sober. I'm not going to drink. Brave man. Brave man. Okay. I think, um, you're set, man. Listen. You are going to smash this date, yeah? We don't need that you liquid courage right confident now. confident, like, and you say her first name straight away. Straight away. Straight in. Smiling. Show them all your teeth. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Show them all the teeth. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I think the first one's about to start. Oh, I'm, ner hey, I'm nervous. Oh, well, like, okay. All right, I'm, cool. Listen, am I going to get it? Am I going to get it? I got you know to make, make crap proud. Peace, boy. All right, peace. I'm going to click on this. Okay, bye. Cool. This is making me more, more nervous that Emily is away. Okay, when you are ready, enter your video day with Maya. Best of luck. Okay, cool. I feel like I'm on a date with Vinny now. Oh, she ditched us, dude. She kept us hanging. Or maybe she's not punctual. Hello! Hi! Sorry, I needed to be. <laughs> Hi! No, I'm gonna get that. I can't argue with that then. That's fine. That's, that's what you need to do. Okay. So she's Cheers. drinking. How are you, Vinny? I'm, I'm good, thank you very much. I, I think I can slightly detect an accent. Am I correct? You're so, very observant. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where do you think I'm from? I've heard, I've actually heard a few footballers interviewed that sound a little bit like you. Um, yeah, footballers from my country are very good. Some of the best in the world, I will say, personally. <laughs> she's Spanish, right? She's 100% Spanish. There's no, she's not Belgian. I don't think, no, she's not Danish or Hungarian. I feel like if she was Danish, she would be a lot wider. That's not, I don't think that's being racist. Um, okay, hold on. Now that we're paused here, let's take a look at her room. I like her setup here. I like the I like the little lights. I do like the little little cubbies on the wall, which is nice. She's got some shoes, not too many shoes, but she's got enough shoes. Some platform or some high heels, some sneakers, some flats. She's got some art there. She's got her bed there. She's drinking, but it also looks like it could be like Welch's grape juice. It don't even that doesn't even look like wine. It looks like it could be like like purple Kool Aid. Um, Wallpaper's a little bit tacky, in my opinion, but it, yeah, whatever. She got a nice smile. She's cool. I like a Spanish. That has to be a Spanish accent, surely. Muy bien. Very yes. Cool. Okay. Yes. <laughs> I'm very impressed. How do you know? I think I just, I don't know, probably but, just a good ear for these kind of things. Yeah, just... come on. I know. It was a lucky guess, right? Or not do it. I don't know. Everyone can recognize a Spanish accent, right? I mean, it's awkward because I'm actually Portuguese, so. <laughs> but all of Siberians sound the same to you. I get that. Hell yeah, you do. No, no, no. Oh my god, I'm. Oh, I fucked that sorry. up. I'm so sorry. I didn't. I thought I'd heard people. I fucked up. I just up. heard people that sounded quite like you, so I didn't. <laughs> I, so... I knew it. I knew. <laughs> She's joke. She's joking, dude. I'm Spanish. I knew it. Are you it. serious? Yeah, I'm Spanish. I'm from Granada. Yeah. So she's got a sense of humor. So you are actually Spanish. She, she, oh, yeah. she got a sense of humor. Telling the truth last I'm time. Spanish, but be careful what you say about everyone can understand, you know. I thought I knew. I was so... No, you did. Gosh, you did, you did. my heart. But it was a, you are a bit cocky, you know. I have to... Hey, sometimes you got to so show that off. You know what I mean? I've been treating you. I know there are lockdown questions. So boring. Okay, no, no. We, we, we don't have to talk about it if you... If you I'm kidding. <laughs> 
Bro, this, this guy sucks, I mean, dude. It's really busy. I'm a language teaching assistant, so... It's like ESL. Oh, wow, nice. Uh, what languages? Spanish, obviously. Yes, Spanish. In English. And then Italian and French as well. So I've been doing online classes with my students and then some private tuition, too. So it's my side hustle. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. That's pretty cool. Mm. The good thing about languages is no matter how hungover you are, you never forget them. <laughs> that's very <laughs> yeah, true. That's fair, that's fair. And I, I noticed that... Um, <laughs> What's up, Bard? No, it's not what we're watching, yeah, dude. Yeah, which one? What are we Simple playing, computer? bro? Um, okay, they all grab my attention immediately. But... If I had to pick one thing about the amazing things about you, I would pick... Sure, right. yes. I that's get exactly it, I what get I meant. It. That was underneath. <laughs> I really dig that you are into arts and We're playing this dating yeah, simulator. Definitely. Mark, we're trying to get laid, bro. We're trying to get a girlfriend. So help, help okay, me out. Come. Help me I out here. I think, like, as I get older, I want to learn more about the cultural side of cities, you know? Oh, yeah. I mean, London is one of the best places for that. And, uh, well, okay, okay. The question, next question is, what kind of stuff are you looking for? Oh, um, well, everything but, like... I want to learn more about history and uh, see more museums. You're right, the best museums, I think. Some <laughs> yeah, of them are yeah kind of both, so, yeah. Sure. Plays, it's a, it's a decision-based game. I want to go to more theater. You love plays? Oh, okay, now we're talking. This is great. Yes, I saw that on your profile because you, you like it too, right? Yes, I do, I do. Maybe you could be my, my tour guide. <laughs> I mean, if you don't mind me talking your ear off, then yeah, for sure. I'll take you some places that I know in London. I don't mind that at all. I want to learn everything. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to go like Big Ben or whatever. I want to see like real London, right? Okay. I feel like I, this is something I could offer. It's pretty cool. I know like some really cool spots. Your tour guide services. It's like Vinny takes London, yeah? Hell yes. yeah, dude. Vinny takes London. You can buy me a drink as, as a payment. Do you know what I mean? So. <clears throat> Sorry. I get a bit aggressive when I'm passionate about something. I dig it. Okay, so really quick, I I actually kind of dig her. I think she her, her she is a little bit on the definitely more of the extroverted side, which matches with Vinny because Vinny is definitely a little bit more reserved. But you can tell that she brings that like excitement out of him a little bit, which is really cool. Um, you know, he's he's not, he hasn't stopped smiling this entire time. Um, I think she she's she is very jokey. She's very she can be sarcastic, so I think that could make it fun. She's not bland, that's for sure. So it wouldn't be it wouldn't be a boring relationship right off the bat. I'll tell passionate. What? Is passionate? You said passionate. Oh shit! <laughs> He's mansplaining, dude. Sorry, it's, it's the wine. <laughs> You can always correct me when my English is bad, please. No, 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 listen, I promise you it's perfect. It's perfect. Oh, I'll correct you, all right. Okay, well, it's definitely not, is it? But I have a question for you, Vinny. Okay, go on. I'm all is. Would you call yourself introverted or extroverted? Okay. Oh, I said that right, yeah? Oh, okay. Okay. Well, this, 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 this is a big question now. Are we... You have a thing, I'll have a drink. Are we... Okay. Are we talking for Vinny or are we talking for ourselves here? I'm going to, I feel like going for a bit of both is, is definitely the way to go here. Because even in, in Vinny, you can tell that he's able to talk and, and kind of be lighthearted, but he's also a little bit reserved. Like he's definitely careful with what he says in his words. I do feel like he's, he's definitely not like a full on extrovert. But he's not a full-on introvert either. But what would Vinny think he would be? I feel like this Vinny would probably think he was like an introvert, in my opinion. But I'm gonna, I think we're going to go with a bit of both. I'd have to say that it's probably a mix. I think I'm, I'm happy being around people, and then I'm also happy being on my own. So, I don't know. I have to be able to do both in That's life. good. Yeah. I think that's really good. Yeah. I need to mix it well, up. What if we get I'm all three girls, dude? Crazy one with my friends. Oh, are you? <laughs> Can we be in like a quadruple? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Instead what's of a some thruple? craziness that's happened with like friends? Like what's a... Oh, you don't want to know. Oh, yeah, okay. We got this shit, dude. We got her in the back. Dude. She, she, we'll she, she, she loves me. Time, she loves me already. You'll find out. Okay, okay. You'll find yeah. out. <clears throat> oh, later, dude. We got disconnected. Our Wi-Fi is shit. I'm still here. 
I love you. He's crying. Why is he crying? Sorry. Why is he? Why is? Why is he crying? So, how long have you been here, Maya? Is he just high? Like two years. I was I was traveling around Europe with my ex, and then we just got to London. We decided to settle here. So. Wow, that's a that's a big step. Well, we were together since we were teenagers. So, so this we're might be still friends. We're very close. We live near here. Shit, that might be an issue oh, here. What, what was it? Uh, was it a recent breakup? Yeah. Um, she was like crime. Oh fuck off, bro. That's why she's drinking. She's depressed as hell. I'm joking. It was like a year ago. Oh my <laughs> gosh. That's that's quite soon after you got here, though. Yeah, well, you know, it's different when you're traveling. It's just bro. Like fun. And bro, dude, I can't handle this girl right now, dude. She's got, she, I don't know. She's so unpredictable. I love it. Yeah. I'm about to, I'm yeah, about to I'm leave Katie <laughs> for her. Yes, I have. <laughs> um, but, you know, I'm hoping to find my London boy on the app. Oh, so, so you're into London, guys, yeah? Maybe, maybe. We anyway, need to come to London like town. People need to smile more, right? It's like you get on the bus or the train and, like, Everyone just looks miserable. <laughs> Trust me, it's the weather. Don't even talk to me about the weather in this country. <laughs> oh, com coming from Spain so to mess. London? It's like, no. Okay. Uh, do you miss home? What are you I'm drinking? Like, Why did you like my profile? Certain things. Really? Just... Yeah, what, are you, what are you drinking? I'm mystifying you, okay? <laughs> yes, somewhat. Ask me anything. Okay, uh, okay, then question number one. What's in the glass? Oh, uh, it's just some red wine. That's my favorite. Anything in particular? Uh, no, I don't really care. No. To be honest, as long as I get me wrong. Okay, okay. That's so bad. I know I should know more. I should know more. I used to work in a wine bar. No, it's understandable. Maybe that's why I, I, I got you. fired. Yeah. Dude, she's goofy as hell. <laughs> she's goofy. Oh, but you're not drinking, right? Okay, so I wasn't sure about the first video date protocol. Come on, man. A drink always helps. You know, you get to know someone better. Okay, yeah, but they don't need to. And we've covered a lot of ground so far, haven't we? Oh, my gosh, so you're like a monk, huh? Bruh. No. <laughs> I almost look so, like, uncivilized to you. Uncivilized. It's, it's uh, don't, uncivilized. Don't correct her, bro. Un civilian. Un got, got it. Yeah. Dude, that's okay. so that's so um, that's so cringe, how's dude. This online digital dating thing going for you? Have you enjoyed it? It's okay. I mean, I love going out and meeting people, but like, it's it's a good it's a close second. On a, on a first date, dude, weird. you definitely, you definitely want a man's play as much as you can. That's out. definitely a good way to go. To uh huh. Yeah, kind of, but like, I think it's actually been good for me to like weed out the bad ones. Sure. So when I do, it's like you know. Nice, nice. Yeah. Dude, she's devouring that glass. I finally some weed. Oh, really? I managed to find the only dealer working through lockdown. Come on, let's light up. Okay, I'm coming. Who the fuck is that? Going well with Tom. Who the fuck is Tom? Laugh it off. Let her explain. Let her explain. Me, Tom. I'm a Tom. Um. Do you know IG is cool? I think I've, I've. People have always said that I look like a Tom. Oh, trust me, you're much better looking than Tom. I am? Okay. Uh, thank you, I think. <laughs> no, well, who is Tom anyway? Is he like another... I In don't fact, know. You know like what? He, he... Forget Tom. He... I don't want to know about right. Tom. He's exactly. whatever. Exactly. My flatmate's an idiot and he just doesn't know what he's talking about. I bet he was fucking around just to make <sighs> me jump. I you can tie a bag if you don't come now. I'm coming. I'm coming. Sorry. You gotta go. I do. Um, no, it's fine. I'm so sorry. I told him that if he got some weed, that I would just smoke it with him straight away. No, it's no problem at all. We had, um, listen, we had a great chat this yeah, evening. Priorities, 100%. Yeah, definitely. I mean, um, I think you're really cool, so. Yeah, I think <laughs> you're cool too. Um, okay, well, see you later. All right. See you later. You're gonna make a baby now or what, dude? What the fuck? She gave me a kiss, dude. Let's fucking go, dude. When you are ready, enter your video date with Grace. Uh, I forgot what Grace was. What does she do? Can we can we see? Oh, we were at eighty percent match with Maya. Holy shit, bruh! Damn. No wonder we were hitting it off with her.
55% with Grace, 55% with Saffron, 53 with Shina, Shayna, whatever, and Paige. Dang. Okay, so we're, 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 we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Everyone's having a good time. Hello, Vinny. Oh, uh, hi. Hi, so I'm so sorry. You weren't waiting long, were you? No, not too long. Grace was so, the weird Vinny, job that wasn't specific or the other. Am I first digital date in this new normal we're living through? Put me under the spotlight already. That's a tough question to ask. No, I'll, I'll, um, be, I'll be honest. It's hard. Just be... would think it would be like, yeah, no. Uh, no, uh, you're not, I'll be honest. Okay, well, you can teach me the ropes then, digital Casanova. Oh, listen, I, I, I got this. I think I'm getting the hang of it all and... Okay. I kind of... Okay. <laughs> so, on your profile, it said your industry was other. I was just wondering what you do. Yeah, I'm in corporate law. Um, wow, okay. A little bit shocked that they didn't have a litigation option. I'll, I'll send them some feedback. Sure. I'm a little bit extra like that. So, um, I mean, I presume you've been busy during lockdown. Yeah, apparently the world never stops needing legal advice. Um, I've just been made partner at my firm. So it's a whole new step up trying to make relationships with the clients and video calls are just no way to do it. Dude, I'm, I'm texting. I'm, I'm bored as hell right now. Amazing I'm bored as fuck. Yeah, it's not very polite to remind a woman of her age. Oh, bro, dude. Okay, I, I'm, I'm, so, uh, I'm, I'm done. So I'm done. It was nothing about your age. It was more I'm just only, about that you. I'm only pulling my leg. Yeah, she better be pulling I'm my leg. I'm a little bit younger than what I would normally go for, though. Really? Hmm. Well, I guess. Why did you go for me then? We share similar interests. It looks like um, when I get time off, I love like music, traveling, eating. Emphasis on eating. Yeah, big Eat. emphasis, big foodie here. Eating and what? A big share of food. I'm one of those people that when they go to a restaurant, I just unashamedly order everything off the menu. Starters, mains, desserts, everything. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Big share as well, yeah? Yeah, I mean, I just feel like that's part of eating. It's like a social thing. But I it, really hope you're on the same page as me. If she, if she buys all that shit off the menu, does she, like, finish it all? Or does she take it home? Or does she leave it there? and waste it because that's a huge that's a big deal man i'm not down to be with this chick if she orders five hundred dollars worth of food and then is like oh yeah i'll have like two clams and some asparagus and then goes home and doesn't take any of it back you know what i mean like that's I don't mind sharing my food, though. Okay, so I'm going to tell you right now, I'm on exactly the same page. Like, I'm sold. I have no issue at all with scoffing my face at any time of the day. Okay, phew. That could have been really awkward. So what about your skills in the kitchen? Oh. I, obviously, can cook up a storm. Can you? But it's always nice when a guy knows his way around a stove. I'm okay. pretty, I, personally, okay. I'm pretty intermediate. Can you say something to reassure me here? I'm I'm not advanced. I'm not I'm not like a um, I'm not a Gordon Ramsay or like a Anthony Bourdain, but I'm also like not basic that I can only boil water. Like I cooked I cooked today. So I've got a few dishes up my sleeve that are a bit known to impress over the time. So such as okay, so I make some pasta dishes. Hell yeah, pasta. Um, I can make a really mean roast, and I have pretty simple baking skills. If you've got a sweet tooth. A solid repertoire. Hell yeah, dude. Make some, make some brownies, yeah, so bro. Not, not too bad. I think I can hold my own in the kitchen enough. Can always learn more, too. Just about. Ooh. Just about. Just about. Just about. Just about. Yeah. Yeah. I'd really like to know how come you're single. Your guess is as good as mine. I'm going to fall back on that old cliche that I haven't met the right person yet. What about you? No, no listen. Cliches are often true. Right? I'm a big defender of cliches. Anyway, stop avoiding the question. Okay. <laughs> Tell me the answer. What's your relationship history? Single for a while. Okay. Recently single. To be honest. Never had a girlfriend. I'll just say single for a while. I'm gonna say we had a girlfriend, and I think so. Let's make some. Let's make some backstory for Vinny. I'm gonna say he's been single for a while. I'm gonna say he had he, he had a he had a decent relationship going on. She broke his heart, and it took him a while to finally get back into the game right and now he's like ready to start trying and then it's like 
he's kind of new to the whole Tinder dating online thing. You know what I mean? I think that's good. Because that's what happened yeah. to me. Well, I, listen, I've been single for a while. Okay, if I'm honest, I haven't actually been in anything meaningful for a long time. Interesting. So are you looking for something meaningful on here? What, what exactly are you looking for? Oh, that's a big question. That is a big question. It's a big question. We're it's going question. balls deep, dude. Oh, I know. Going all in. So you're always hoping that the other person is on the same page, but I'm, I'm, I'm looking to be in a relationship, yeah. I mean, these days I'm pretty set on that, and when I meet the right women, yeah, I'm just programmed that way, I guess. Yep. She's not digging it. Okay, I'm the same. I just don't oh. bother wasting my time on things I'm not serious about. That's what I'm saying. Okay, good, yeah. I'm, I'm glad that we... We're on the, the same, same page. Story. Yeah, 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 completely. Okay. So, Vinny, sorry, my schedule is just a little bit crazy at the moment, and... Um, I kind of need to go soon. Oh. Is there anything else you fancy asking me? Yeah, oh, that's such a shame. Um, okay. You've got my full attention though for a few more minutes. So think wisely. Okay. Any burning questions? Maybe just tell me a bit more about your upbringing and how you got to be such a high achiever. Oh, don't flatter me. <laughs> that's a good um, question, Vinny. Good like job. Tell, really. I was really lucky to go to a good school, girls' school. Nice. Got really good grades. Did ballet. Did lacrosse in my county. I still keep those up casually. That's pretty impressive, I have to admit. Thank you. Um, I just have the most amazing family. My parents are just so brilliant in their own ways. They're my idols, really, and they just have this amazingly strong love. Hey, listen, it's I didn't think I would out. like her. They are amazing. But and she what seems kind of cool. Are you, are you close with your family? Hell yeah. Ooh, I uh, in simple terms. Yeah, simple is always best, I think. Just be honest. I'm not a big fan I of really, really red am. nail polish. I just have so much to thank them for, just for, I don't know, making me the man that I am today and the man that I'm still becoming. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, no, no, no. Family is really, really important to me. Yeah, I agree. Couldn't agree more. Well, I'm going to go now. Sorry if I was a bit outspoken. That's just me. No, it's, just, it's cool. It's just, I really know who I am and what I want and... I just don't want to waste my time, you know? No, I understood. You could tell her to chill out. <laughs> I understand. It's, it's better to, you know, get that stuff out in the open. So, you know, being honest is always the best. Wouldn't be anything else. This felt really good. You're a good egg, Vinny. You feel good. Yeah, you're not too bad yourself, Grace. Charming. Charming. Have a good evening. Dang, dude. We can already set up a threesome right now if we really wanted to, I bet. Dude, Vinny's killing it right now. Let's fucking go. Sorry. I don't even care about Saffron anymore. Hello? She's not even gonna show up. She's not even gonna show up. She's gonna stand us up. <laughs> Vinny! <laughs> Hi! I'm so glad you're still there. Sorry I'm late. No, so she, she, she's an yeah, artist. Okay, sorry, I was just doing yoga and I like completely zoned out. Do you mind if I just tidy this up once? I'll be really quick. No, please, please, go ahead. Thank you so much. I'll have to, to wait. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm just gonna light some incense because there is some very sweaty energy in here. <laughs> All right. That's better. Nice. Okay. I'm with you. I think it's pretty uh, it's pretty cool that you're keeping active during lockdown. Oh my gosh, it's like the only way I could keep my equilibrium. <laughs> Have you? been like keeping active or doing any exercise during lockdown at all like what just walking or <laughs> <laughs> anything any kind of exercise just keeping active oh actually i do keeping I, dude yoga is the fucking shit dude believe it or not i actually do yoga too shut up bro dude we're getting all of them we're getting pegged you for a yogi all of them i'm actually bro. still pretty limber do you want to you want to do a pose together? Let's do a chaturanga, bro. Chaturanga. Yes. Amazing. Okay. Chaturanga. 
Let's do the the cow okay, pose, so bro. This is the revolve chair pose. Reverse cowgirl. Yes. Okay. I'll admit it. I'm actually really <laughs> impressed. <laughs> How is my technique? Good. That was very yeah. That was pretty good. We literally both did the same thing as well. <laughs> Yeah, you made Grace so angry. It's weird seeing her nice. Oh, that's so funny. How'd you make her angry? <laughs> well, listen, thank you for breaking the ice, Saffron. It's my specialty. So, I haven't asked, what is it that you do for a living you know, when you're not breaking the ice? A yoga instructor? Um, I'm a project manager for an animal welfare charity. Oh my goodness, that's should, really cool. She's a hippie. I've actually been a vegan for about 10 years. I'm vegetarian, let's go, dude. Mind if I ask what you eat? I'm fucking vegetarian, yeah, bruv. Not at all, it's... So not sharing food, right looking right. for something casual. <laughs> she didn't like it. Oh no, crap, dude! What are you doing, bro? I've actually been a vegetarian for a few years now. Oh, True well, story, you too. The next step to veganism. Do you know what? I, I just don't know enough about it to be honest. Well, I won't try to brainwash you. Vegetarianism definitely makes things easier. <laughs> Where are your eyes wandering off to? <laughs> your uh, your living room is confusing, eccentric. <laughs> no, fascinating. What interests you most? The boy. Uh, wait, hold on. I can't. Uh, let me look at. I don't want to look at Vinny, dude. What does the book say? Impressionist palette. There's a lot of boobs. Pottery. The photographs. The books. Uh. Dude, look at this face, dude. What is up with her face? The photographs. Uh, what's up with the photographs? There's, there's like, there's three of her. Let's do the pottery. Pottery sounds funny. There are actually some really interesting pieces of art over there. Ah, you're staring at my boob pots. Boob pots. Let's go, yeah. dude. <laughs> I attend these um pottery classes, and I like made these collection of pots with female breasts. In all different shapes and sizes. I feel like they're all really beautiful. Shout out boobs, dude. Hey, listen, Let's go. Into that. What do you think? Okay, okay. I think. I won't be offended. Come on, just tell me. <laughs> I think that they are beautifully crafted. A sort of rustic, but with real detail too. I actually think that you're really, really talented. So. Okay, you've gone completely overboard there, but... Well, just, you know. Thank you, you're very sweet. <laughs> I'm being honest, I, I, they kind of look like aliens, to be honest. Anyway, I've spoken way too much, so it's your turn to tell me about you. Oh, uh, I'm really not great at talking about myself. Oh, you know what we could do? Ask me There's a question. this ultimate compatibility test that's only three questions. Do you want to do it? Okay, let's go for it. Okay, so question one is, do you like horror films? Oh, I just have to give a simple yes or no answer, yeah? Mm-hmm, very straightforward. Okay, so this is this is tough because I, I don't, in general, like horror films. They're not like go-to films to watch, but like, I do enjoy them, if that makes sense. Like, I, like, I won't go out of my way to watch The Exorcist, but like the uh, like, there's some times where I'll be like, you know what? I really want to watch the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, the original one, because it's such a good movie, or like House of a Thousand Corpses, you know, um, things like that. But then there's also like, I will never watch The Descent again, because that shit scared the shit out of me. Um, but also, Signs is really good. I'm gonna say yes. I think I think we can kind of be in. I think we can be. Oh, in then this is super super easy um I, I love them supernatural ones uh psychological uh, ones thrillers slashes okay. creatures <laughs> so, so, so. i'm gonna stop you there what? i'm so sorry i cannot stand them no why oh that's such a shame because they're so good to watch with people yeah i mean what is there a reason like why don't you like them I just, um... Bad experience? To be perfectly honest with you, I suffer from, like... I suffer from anxiety really bad. That's understandable. I'm so sorry to hear that. It's okay. I, I keep it under control with my lifestyle choices, but... Yeah, that, that makes sense. I used sense. to get panic attacks really badly, so Anything... I just try to avoid, like, yeah. triggers. Right. 
like scary movies. Right, right. I can I can understand that, that, especially if there's anything that like has sexual assault just or like if someone's been physically assaulted, it, people don't want to like re-experience that. Uh, have you ever traveled to another country? Like? I can Ooh, definitely I understand have that. Have to think about that for a second. Um... Yeah, I know it's kind of hard to remember that kind of stuff. <laughs> okay, no, it's not. Okay, I don't know if this counts. I have. Um, I studied abroad in Bologna in Italy, and that was just that was crazy. I mean, I love traveling, but I actually don't think I've ever been alone. You haven't? No. no. Okay, I find mm. that surprising. I know. You kind of would have thought I had, right? I seem like the type. <laughs> uh, how comes you haven't traveled alone yet? No, don't get me wrong. Like, it's different from a woman, that's for I damn sure. Hey, look, I'm Picasso. Yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> you uncultured <laughs> swine. What are you looking at? I'm getting that completely. That's perfect, dude. She's uncultured. She's Finally, an uncultured swine, dude. Could you pack up your life and live? <laughs> <laughs> wow. That is a left of question. Just imagine yourself, uh, yeah, completely alone. Completely isolated. Mm -hmm. Again. Floating along. Okay, so this is interesting because she so when she asked this question, she seems like super excited about it, like she's all into it and shit like that. Um, I already have a girlfriend. No, I, yeah, well maybe I I met this girl named Maya that we were vibing really well, but she she was drinking quite a, quite a bit. But um, we'll see what happens. You, you we'll we'll see how your competition is. Um, I, I don't like the idea of living on a boat, but I think it'd be interesting. Do you know what? I reckon I could. I think I'm... If she says no to this, too, then and this chick sucks, dude. Thinking about it she's now, a, she's a front, sort of dude. She's a total front. Probably a bit of me. But, okay, disclaimer, my sea legs aren't great, <laughs> but I guess that's just something you'll get used to. Yeah, no, same. I could do it in a heartbeat. I feel like lockdown is going to be great. Oh, right, that makes sense. That yeah, makes yeah, sense, yeah, I'm, there, I'm there with you. You get have a good day today. Well, that was a bit of a disaster, wasn't it? What the fuck do you mean? It was a disaster. Smidge. How is it a disaster? Ah, <sighs> I mean, do you really trust all these personality tests? <laughs> Vinny, just because I'm a hipster, it doesn't mean that I base my life off obtuse thinking <sighs> and mysticism. Okay, no, no, you're right. Ooh. However... I did actually notice that our star signs are super compatible. What the hell is That's she? That's good. This is a good sign. What is sign, she? Sign. Thank you so much for this evening, Vinny. I had a really lovely time. Yo, let's fucking go, go, dude. Really beautiful energy. We're three Thank for you, three. And, uh, three for three, bro. Yeah, it's just a, a real pleasure talking this to you. This is how I got Katie, too. Bro, I got, I got Riz. I got Riz blowing out my ears, dude. Whoa, quick answer. Hey, mate, I've been on tental hooks for this debrief, man. You were just waiting in bed for me to call you, weren't you? Bro, stop deflecting, man. Details, details. So, there was Maya. Uh. And, man, she was a real live wire from Spain. From Spain? Ho, ho. Hey, you got to love the mamacitas. <laughs> How'd it go? How'd it go? Do you know what? Uh-huh. It was great. <laughs> She seemed really cool, and I think she's into me. These are the real That's video video dates right boy. here. Yeah, yeah. Well done. <laughs> the, well, the one with well this. Well done, boy. <laughs> I like this guy. He's I a, can't stop smiling. He's um, a good. He's funny. Uh, we need to do some more. He's a good friend, around, man. Surname? Oh, I don't know. Give me something to work with, man. Uh, well, she's Spanish, obviously, uh, and she's uh -huh. a language teacher in French and Italian. Does that help? Boom! Got her. You got Online her. language tuition database. Maya Orantes from Granada. This is stalking, oh, oh. bro. Okay. Yes. Uh, hold on. Let me, let me see if this is her, yeah? That is definitely her. Uh, uh, this is her. This is her. This is her. <laughs> Stay strong. The weekend is coming. Oh, Eight posts. 9K yeah. views. 1, 4, 20 followers. Okay. Okay, so she goes to shows. She's barefoot. She likes uh, pastries or cakes. Um, that's from her room. She does the duck face. Uh, that's oh, it's a dope ass sunset photo though. If that's actually what she took, that's a pretty damn good photo. Okay, always in my heart. Live for the night. Okay. 
See what you needed to see? Yeah, man. All right, all right. Sweet. So Grace, uh, yeah, she was really high achieving okay. and very intense. Yeah, Grace was know, interesting. I kind of enjoyed that. Mm. Sounds pretty good. Definitely very, very stable. Yeah, listen, I could tell she likes me, man. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. The boy is out of the traps. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm. I, yeah. It was good. Yeah. <laughs> it was good. I think it went really well. So. Yes, man. Of course it did. You're a catch. You're a catch. You're the catch. <laughs> Bruh, dude. I'm going to date this guy, man. Straight up, info. dude. He's making Surname? me blush. Uh, no. Don't remember. Anything? She was just made mm, yeah. partner at a big law firm. She had litigation. So that's what I said. I think I got her, Grace Huckle Renford, but oh, she's only listed as an associate at the law firm. Huckle Renford, yeah. Okay, let me take a look. She's got three names, dude. I mean, she's like, she's like a, she's rich. Oh yeah, that's definitely her. This is her. This Five is her. This is, yeah, this is her. Yeah. <laughs> the best of me is yet to come. So, this is her. Yeah, no, 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 I'm not lying. This is her. The, all right, all right, all right, cool. The only thing with Grace was that I, I'm not a fan of red nail polish. I don't know what it is. It's just not my thing. You know what I mean? So she doesn't post a lot. Maya posted a little bit more. So she drinks wine, throwback to Jess's party, business trips to, it looks like New York. Working from home, corporate law. So she works from home. Okay. Um, she has a friend named Jess and that's that. So she's just definitely very, very professional. And it makes sense why she wouldn't have a bunch of stuff on her Instagram or whatever this is because she needs to be a professional she needs to have a professional look to her profile so based off stereotypes that's usually what what needs to be done you get the lowdown on grace i think so i think so nice so saffron yeah um where to start she had a lot going on she had this super cool hipster vibe okay and she made boob cups do you know what? Oh, uh, no. Was it was it terrible? It went really well, man. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I am proud of you, mate. Yeah? Vinny is proud. Oh, no. I said my name is Vinny. Shit. <laughs> I am proud of you, my guy. Listen, Callum is proud of Vinny. Vinny should feel vindicated. <laughs> you get anything else? Surname, anything. So just a job, but I reckon I could find it. There can't be too many sufferings nearby. Okay. Very true, yeah. I'm just going to have a look now. It's a very specific name. Oh, my goodness sakes. I found her. I found her. Yeah, she's big. Ah. Hip, she's big hippie lady. Yeah, this is her. Don't forget to water your house plants. Oh, that's look at that's for you, Katie. Don't forget to water your house plants. Eight posts, 2K views, 534 followers. Uh, she loves the outdoors. Hello from the underground. Is that kombucha? Uh, I named her Daff. Okay. Uh, she got septum piercing. Light it up. Uh, what does that say at the very bottom there? Bored. Tranquility equals goals. The yogi life and blue. Okay. Why does she look so like? Why she doesn't she doesn't smile in any of these pictures except for these top ones, I guess. But okay. Yep. You get what you need. I think so. All right, bro. That's for you, then. Well, just remember, mate. You've now got to tell the app which two girls that you like, so you can ask them out on the second day. Oh, <gasps> do I? Oh, why does it work like that? I don't know, to stop girls getting strung along and catching feelings. Bro, I don't know, I didn't make the app. Just just answer. I need to think on it. Um, Planties. But listen, thank you for your help, and I'm going to get some sleep, and I'll catch you tomorrow. Yeah? No problem, bro. Have a good one, yeah? See you later. Good night. Okay, so... So we have to pick two. We can't just continue with all three of them. Why, why, does it, why doesn't it allow us to get all three of them? Okay, so this is Maya. She's 22, so she's a little bit younger. She's 5'4". Education. She is a speech therapist or whatever. Arts, culture, party. She might be a little bit too much of a partier. That's the big thing. Saffron's cool. She is a Virgo. We are two Virgos. She's creative. 
Um, she's a yoga. She does yoga stuff. She is into charity and stuff, which is kind of cool. Um, Grace is 27. Five, five, um, two for two second dates. I'm going to go with. I think Maya has to be one at least. And then. We'll probably have to go with Saffron, I think. Oh, Maya accepted the second date. Oh, we didn't get a second date with. with... Oh, we got Saffron. Let's go. for this evening second dates are game dates maya has chosen truth or dare sweet um i have to come right back guys i have to take luna out to go to the restroom and then i will be right back um Made it just in time. We made it just in time. Say hi. Say hello. We're getting dates. We're getting dates. We're getting dates. We're gonna get laid. We're gonna get laid. We're gonna get little. Oh. All right. So your second date with Maya has been scheduled for this evening. Second dates are game dates. Maya has chosen truth or dare. Let's fucking go. Oh, there he is, wide awake. 
<laughs> and you're like my mum now, man. What's the crap? Uh, I have a second date with Myers, man. My boy. Um, uh, game day, right, yeah? Yeah, she's chosen to play Truth or Dare. Hey, wild. You are onto a winner here, bro. You're going to get busy with it. Uh, do you know what? Listen, I'm not going to lie. I am a little bit nervous. Bro, this is the exact reason why. Just have a little taste, yeah? Dutch courage, mate. Do it, man. Oh, what does that say? I should probably put this over here so I can read. Uh, wait, what am I saying? Yes or no to? What, wait, what the fuck am I saying? Yes or no to here? This is a great freeze frame of him. Um, is this a connection here thing? I don't know. I'm going to say no again. Do you know what? No. Because I don't know what to expect from digital truth or dare, so I just kind of need to keep my wits about me, to be honest. Ugh, bruv, don't be so paranoid. What? The, oh, what, the what, drinking what, thing? asked me to do some freaky shit? True. She could film it. And leak it. Yo, are you serious? Hmm. You'd become a big, huge laughing stock. <laughs> oh, shut <laughs> You're not helping, Callum. Jeez. I've literally lost my appetite. I can't even eat my sandwich anymore. Anyway, there's potential here. Have you heard anything else from her since the first date? You know, I have actually. She sent me one of those video messages over the app. Let me see. Was it naughty? No, no, I can't. Because it may be a little cheeky, actually. Ah. Oh. Oh, come on. Now you got to show me, man. Okay, cool, I'm gonna screen share. Hey, Vini, I'm finally in the sunshine and I'm loving it, but I'm thinking about our next date. I can't wait to see you, see you soon. She big smoking. She big pie head guy. You right there, bud? <laughs> she seems bubbly. That's, what I, that's what I said. Actually. I said uh, bubbly. Keep me updated, lad, yeah? yeah. I will. All right, cool, man. We'll catch you there. Cool, bro. Have fun. Bye. When you are ready to enter your video day with Maya, best of luck. Okay, so let's go. She's drinking again. Fuck yeah, let's go. Hey, hey. Hey, Vinny. <laughs> hey, shit. I'm sorry. I'm the one who's late this time. No, no, it's okay. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. It's okay. I I wanted to show you that I I can be reliable. Oh, that's okay. That's nice. But you won't you won't wait long, will you? you... Only like an hour or two. It's like it's not. Right. But I'm glad you waited for an hour. <laughs> anyway, so. Just a couple seconds. It's nice to see you. Dang, settle down, so bro. How have you been? Um, I'm good. Uh, just been keeping busy. A routine has been a blessing in disguise through this whole thing. So, how about you? Yeah, same here, to be honest. Yeah, um, crap. If you're still there, I definitely still see it. I can tell with like, the whole COVID oh, thing, so like how they're kind long, of right? implement that into the whole storyline. I'm still getting out as much as possible, though. Nice. By the way, I'm I'm not drinking alone, am I? Uh, oh, God. No, I'm not drinking. Is that all right? Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, she's pissed. I just be the alcoholic over here. No, it's fine. I don't oh, give a no, fuck, I don't dude. Think that. Are you sure it's cool? I, I'm sorry. I didn't... It's fine. Whatever. No worries. They should. Uh, you know, you do whatever you want to do, man. It should. It should give me the option uh, to like how come you chose to get a go? drink I like if I wanted to here. It is, you know, it's like you really get to know a person and their limits with it. Limits. Okay. Now I'm worried. Not like that. You know, like just their boundaries. Boundaries, okay, yeah, still worries, still worries. No, you know what I mean. <laughs> it's not like, it's like people really show their true selves and their face was like a deep truth or really top there. It's Okay, no, no, I get you. All right, let's get stuck in. Let's do this, I'm ready. Okay, all right then. Um, oh, it's your go first. Oh, What's it gonna be? Damn it. The uh, big question. Truth, truth or there? <sighs> um, okay. Gosh, I don't trust you. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go truth. I'm gonna go truth. Okay, go to okay, okay. Um, all right. So, okay. When was the last time you cried? Wow, damn. 
Uh, sink or swim, right? Right, uh, it's probably a, a death. I really want to know this. Oh gosh. Um, okay, so not to get too deep, but uh, uh, it's just tough. A friend of mine uh, died last year. Oh my god, Vinny, I'm so sorry. No, it's just fine, it's fine. Uh, but he was sort of the first person I was close to who died. The first one always hits so hard, I mean. It was just a shock to everyone, and it changed all our perspectives. It's okay, Luna, don't cry. I cried at his funeral, leaping back to the question. Sure. Well, my condolences. 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 Oh, shit. <laughs> You know what though? That's kind of Sorry. that's like that's like their like cute <laughs> little Don't thing that they go like, back and forth with like the correcting uh, of the English, no, so and it's nice that she she's willing to like take the correction too. <laughs> I appreciate your condo licenses. <laughs> oh, stop it! That's not fair. <laughs> no, it's fine. Go on, your turn. Okay, let's see what you got for me. Okay, uh, truth or dare? What's it gonna be? Dare. Straight in there. Okay, I like it. <laughs> I'm up for it. Alright, cool. Let's see. Alright, show me your boobs. No, remove four items of okay. clothing. Oh my god. Fun for you. Eat something without using your hands. Uh, what's in your purse? I actually like the idea of what's in your purse. It kind of gives you an insight of more about who she is. I feel like the remove four items of clothing could definitely be a turn off for her. Or maybe if, if she could get a little bit frisky, especially because she's been drinking, but. Uh, I like the purse question. Okay, Maya must show us what's in her purse. Okay. That's kind of a weird one. I mean, you can tell a lot about a person by what they carry around, so... It's true. Well, there's nothing special. Tampons? Um, my little nice. bomb. The bomb. Car keys. keys. What if she pulls out a bag of Coke? So just general stuff, really. A pen. Weed. Weed. Uh, right. Nail varnish. Ooh. I knew it. There's some weed in there. <laughs> some weed. Or some coke, or what is that? Uh, I'm just saving it for after lockdown. Sure. Anyway. See, I knew it. I knew it. I do knew you, it. Are you, so you do that stuff like that. Don't worry. I'm not in here doing it all alone. Sure. Anyone watch industry? Industry? Have we talked? We talked about that before, right? Again. Okay, through the there. Is she in that? Okay, I think I'm gonna. Go for... I'll do. I'll do a dare. I'll do a dare since you did dare. I'm gonna be brave and say dare. Okay. All right. Okay. Is she really? Oh shit! Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Thanks. So these. You have to sex to the last person you texted. Oh. These games have gosh. really getting. They've what, been getting is it some. Like your parents or something? No, it's my friend Callum. Have been getting oh, some whatever. good. I actually have to do this. Good series. actors and actresses. Come on. Fuck it! I'll do it! I'll do it! Yeah. Okay. Okay. You have to um share your screen with me so I can see, and I'm gonna tell you what to write. Okay. At least it's Callum. It's not like our parents. Okay. Cool. Alright. Um. Okay, I'm gonna screen share now. Okay. Alright, you sh I should be sharing. Callum the Bedwetter? Yes. What's that? It's just, uh, it's a long story, but it involves a lad's holiday <laughs> in Budapest and lots of cheap beer, and I'm not saying any more about that. What am I writing? Okay, okay, um, okay. <laughs> Callum, dollar <laughs> dog. I. I have been thinking lows about our time in Budapest. And every time I do, I get rock hard. And oh, I'm shit. Ready to I'm ready. Damn. I need you want to get a hotel room with me? So I oh, can fuck just yeah. Absolutely. That's enough. I'm done. I'm putting a full stop right there. That's... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just getting started. So. Fuck. Don't get too greedy. Okay, that's embarrassing enough. Okay, and I'm sending it... <laughs> Now, oh my god, <laughs> Fuck. I can't Shit. believe you actually said that. Oh gosh, I'm gonna have so much explaining to do because of this. But Cal oh, Callum would I get it. Come you. on, Callum's gonna get so it. So he he's gonna that's, understand. That's he's gonna amazing. Understand. Oh, oh. Okay, um, anyway, back to you, Maya. Truth or dare? Truth, I guess. Um, truth, so, okay, truth. 
What's your biggest fear? Like... Have you ever cheated on someone? Oh. Okay, all right. Uh, it says, Maya. Yes. Okay, Maya. Maya, 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 Maya. Have you ever cheated on someone? Oh, shit. Sorry. Is that too far? No, that's a truth. No, or, it's truth or dare, um... bro. It's not too far. I'm afraid you might judge me. Oh, great. I, I, I wouldn't. I'm going to judge you. If you don't. No, it's okay. It, um, it? I, I have cheated once. Um, my ex, he cheated on me, and then I was so, uh, I was so hurt that I, I tried to hook up with someone else to make him jealous. It was horrible. It just made me feel worse. I mean, you know, what's the thing? The English people say it's like two wrong. Things, don't make a right. You know? Yeah. Uh, two wrongs. They don't don't make a right. They right. Don't make a right. Right. <laughs> yeah. Listen, your ex was a, a dick for cheating on you in the first place. No, it's a, he's a good guy. He's not a good guy. He cheated I mean, on you. You fuck. Kind of what the doesn't sound like it. What the fuck is well, wrong? You don't know him, Benny. Oh, she's still stuck anyway, up on I, him. I, I was younger then. And, um, I would never cheat again, so. Okay. Sure. So she's still kind of hung up on him then. Okay, right. Do you want to do another round? Or we can stop and chat if that works. I don't mind. It's up to you. Come on. Every you must have something in mind. Every time someone says I don't mind, you, you must know. Seriously, it's cool. I don't mind. Whatever you want. Okay. Um, why don't we? Okay, screw it. Let's do another round. Okay, let's keep it the same order. So you go uh, through to there. Okay. Okay, Katie. Oh God, for the last one. This is the final one. So what do you want to do? Go on, truth. Truth. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, yeah, that's good. Have fun with your family. Okay. Um, what's the first thing you'd do if you became invisible? Okay, nice. A lighter one. Yeah, it, um, it looked fun. Um, no, it is. I'm just trying to think of all of the amazing things that could be done. There's so much if you actually think about it. That would be amazing. Okay, I would sneak out during lockdown and... I'd come see you. Oh, uh, that's the right answer. Damn, yeah. dude. Yeah. <laughs> Riz coming out the ears. Oh bruh. my god, I hate being inside. The weather is so nice now as well. You know what? I might go outside soon if that's okay. Sure. Yeah, but it's your turn though. Oh. I will. Have a good day. I'll uh, be. I okay, might there, be on later. I have to finish my drink. <laughs> okay. I'll text you. <laughs> nice. I guess that's better than what the app probably had in mind anyway. So, anyway, I'm glad I got to see you again, Maya. Yeah, you too. Even after meeting with you twice, I don't know. I just feel like I could really grow as someone like you. Settle Good down. Job. That. <laughs> that means a lot to hear. Yeah. Um, and you are honestly one of the most unique people. In a good way, or? <laughs> oh, so a hundred percent in a good way, definitely. <laughs> Listen, I I won't keep you. I'll let you go. Okay. Well, uh, I'll be thinking of you. Okay, bye. <laughs> Stupid, dude. I think the cheating so, thing definitely worked. Or that was a good question, though. I have to say, overall, I really enjoyed our two dates, man. Ah, uh, hey, you know what? That makes me happy to hear that, bro, man. I'm buzzing for you, man. She seems so full of life. And and, and, and and the thing is, I think I could keep up with her. She's fast and she knows what she wants, but... Uh, and I'm sure she would teach your bland, vanilla ass a couple things as well, bruv, innit? <laughs> why, why, why do you always have to say such a nasty thing? You need to learn some stuff, man. Get some flavour in your life. I'm such a nice... People say... No I'm more Riz a, coming out the ears, okay. Just... Nobody says that. All right, bro. Just sleep on it and then make the best call for you, bro. Bro, I appreciate it as always. You know, sometimes I think, where would you be without me? But you know what? You think about that whilst you're sleeping, yeah? Sleep easy, Vin. I'd probably be really rich. Um, I said sleep in... easy, Vin. Go to bed, Vin. <laughs> Good night, bro. <laughs> Your second date with Saffron has been scheduled for this evening. Two second days of games. Tarot reading. Okay. Is that really a game, though? Of course. Right where I expect you to be. Bro, I've been killing these kill streaks recently, fam. 
So listen, I've got my second date with Saffron tonight. Nice work. What's the game? Uh, I think tarot, tarot reading, tarot reading. I think that's. Oh, um, those cards that people use to tell their future. That's okay. the one. That's the one. Yeah, I'm kind of just approaching it with an open mind. It's the best way to be, bro. Have you chatted since the first date? You're gonna hate me, but <laughs> she's actually sent me a vegan recipe over the app, and I'm cooking it right now. Like it's a cauliflower curry. Oh Christ! <laughs> it actually, smells pretty I've good. Heard enough. You know what? Call me later, vegan. <laughs> Uh, get your cucumber ass out of it. Why are people being so I mean to vegans? Bye. Nice ass. Fuck. Knock, knock. Oh my god. Hey, <laughs> sorry. I thought I better be early because of last time. No, no, no. No, you're alright. Oh, and thank you for doing a tarot reading, by the way. I like was looking at the other games. And I was just like, I think this will be a little bit different. Yeah, listen, I don't know much about it, but I'm a willing guinea pig. You are in for a treat, young man. Okay, should we just do this? I'm quite excited. Yes. Okay. So, this is my tarot deck. Nice. <laughs> um, tarot deck should be like really personal to their owner. Um, it sort of acts as a vessel of their energy to give like an authentic reading. So, like, kind of like um, an energy sponge? Yeah. I mean, there are very different types of readings that you can do. Um, but for today, I'm just going to do, like, a simple general reading that goes into your past, present, and future. Do you know what? Sorry, I thought that they only told the future. That is a common misconception. They actually don't tell you anything um, at all, really. <laughs> it's not... <laughs> Hey! No, they just like bring up stuff in your life um, that you can sort of delve into and consider. Cool, listen, let's just get delving. Okay. So, um, the first two cards I pick out are going to pertain to your past. Okay. Nervous. It should be. <laughs> okay. Okay. Which card are you more drawn to? The moon or the page of pentacles? Okay, and uh, you're not gonna give me any tips, right? Like, you're not gonna tell mm -hmm. me which one's better and it's gonna tell me I'm more amazing. That's <laughs> not how this works. Okay, uh, the moon, moon, I'm gonna go with the moon. Okay, the moon, lunar leaning. Interesting choice. Because Luna's right here. Um, right, so do you prefer upright or reversed? I prefer it. Reverse seems like a lobster falling out of the sky. Um. Upright, Up, I'm going upright. Upright? Yeah, <laughs> that's my choice. Okay. <laughs> so in this form, um, the moon card represents a mystery in your past. So like a mystery for me? Perhaps, um, or if there was like a truth that always eluded you, or maybe like a secret that you kept from others. Um, the moon card also represents lofty dreams and a sense of foreboding. Hmm. Does any of that ring true? So I had... What, big hopes that may have been dangerous to pursue? You tell me. Something that people don't know about me is that I actually wanted to be a photographer. There's the dream. What kind? A war photographer. Ah, there's the foreboding. Yeah. How come it didn't work out? Uh, I guess just lots of people encouraged me against... Uh, I chickened out, basically. What am I talking about? I don't know, I just... I was always drawn to pictures of conflicts and, well, from the safety of my classroom, they just informed me of how much injustice there was in the world, just how much cruelty among people. I feel like, I feel like war, war photographers and... are needed, though. Like, you have to see yeah, the reality Yeah, I guess I just wanted to spread that awareness on. myself and maybe yeah. inspire change. Do you know what? I haven't thought about that in so long, so... Damn, thank you for reminding me. <laughs> That's what the cards are for. Yeah, these cards are deep. Very, very deep. Mm-hmm. God, yeah. we live in my past traumas. So this is my present. 
It is indeed. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay, the tower or the two of swords. Good looking cards. Good looking cards. Um, the tower uh, looks like some people falling. Like a crown on the top. Uh, the two of swords. Have we got two swords? Four swords. With a little flower in the middle. Some birds. Something like that. The, co the colors of the tower call out to me more, but I do like this this the somewhat symmetrical aspect of the two two of swords. So, but I, I am going towards the tower a little bit more. Let's go with for sure, for sure, tower. This is one of the most dramatic cards. <laughs> Don't tell me that. <laughs> okay, okay. So, do you like it upright or reversed? I like it. <laughs> I like it. Upright. Oh, I wish you could see it reverse. That would be kind of cool. Uh, reverse. I must. I do th upright. I guess again. We'll go upright. Upright. You sure? Yeah. Sure. Okay. So when the tower stands tall, um, it symbolizes disruption, change, and awakening. Okay. Well. I guess all three of those are very topical right now. It doesn't mean they're relevant to your life, though. Yeah, you're right, you're right. So? Okay, I guess disruption and change is plain for everyone to see. But awakening? Awakening. Okay. I've learned to enjoy my own company a bit more. And I've joined a dating app. So if, if this isn't an awakening of sorts, then I don't know what is. <laughs> Amen to that. And breathe. Cool. I feel like I got it right. <laughs> okay, my guess about my future is as good as yours. So I guess this is where the real mysticism starts, right? It's a very one-sided date. Yeah, these are just like feelings I get. Um, you know, maybe they'll just focus your attention on an outcome you'll want to like achieve or avoid. Sure. Okay. <sighs> it makes me nervous when you do that. That was this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, seven of cups or the four of wands. Four, four, of, four I've, of wands or seven of cups. I've heard um, of the seven of cups before. I'm going to go with like that one. Seven of cups. Seven of cups. Okay. I like, I like cups. And then upright or reversed. Um, I'm going to go reverse this time. I haven't said any reversed. 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 Oh, yeah. shit. Oh, shit. Ah, mm -mm. uh, you're gonna tell me something bad, aren't you? Yeah, look, it's no sunshine and rainbows. Um, Fuck. I'm, um, I'm seeing, like, a sense of being torn um, and, like, negativity and skepticism. Okay, Lord above. Uh, what to make of that? You a skeptic? I like to think I'm not, but... All right, I'm sure you can relate to this one. The older I get, the more of life's harsher experiences I encounter. Yeah. So that could easily make me more skeptic, can make me negative, it can make me bitter. Um, I don't know, it's a slippery slope, but I don't know, I guess I'll always be torn between fall into that way of thinking or resist it. Hmm. Yeah, that's a really perceptive train of thought, actually. I think you'd win that battle. Oh, I'll win that battle yeah. if you're next to me. Yeah. I sense positivity in you. Okay, cool. Okay, that's your last compliment. No more. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for being so open with me with this stuff. Um, not everyone is. is no, what the fuck is up with this audio? All pretty insightful, I have to admit. I learned a lot about you. Good stuff, I hope. Oh, exclusively. Okay, good. <laughs> You um, you articulate your emotions well. Oh, that's cool. That's good to. We didn't need to learn anything about her, dude. Okay, I'm not allowing this whole date to be about me. Okay, thank God. No, it hasn't. 
Okay, listen, what we're doing now is we're going to switch roles. You want to do a reading on me? Yep. <laughs> and we're just going to see what we come up with, and you can laugh at me if you want. Okay, you don't have a deck? Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> okay, how about you pick a card and then I'll, inter <laughs> I'll interpret it for you. Well, that is not how this works, but let's see what we get. Who knows? I might actually be really good at this. So, yeah, sure. Dang. Maybe. Okay, yeah, you shuffle them. Yeah, shuff I'm gonna do that shuffle them. thing that you do then. <sighs> Oh no. Is she getting a panic attack? She's gonna she's getting a panic attack. Saffron? <laughs> Saffron, are you okay? Oh my god, oh my god, I'm not okay, I'm not okay. I'm so hot. I'm so hot, I'm so hot. Uh, <laughs> Saffron? Saffron, is there any, is it? <laughs> Saffron. Hello, hello, hi. Um, I need a, a, a ambulance service, please. I'll connect you now. Thank you. Ambulance service. What's the address of the emergency? I, I, uh, What's I, up, Hex? I don't know um, the address because I was on a video call to them. So tell me I exactly what. So really, really quick rundown for you, Hex. So we're playing this game called Five Dates, right? You start off um, picking out these different people that you want to go on dates with. You end up picking three total. Um, so we picked Maya, Grace, and Saffron. So Maya went really well. She's this Spanish girl, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Grace was a lit uh, lawyer or something like that. And then Saffron is like a creative yogi or whatever. We ended up getting uh, second dates with Maya and Saffron. Both went well. But what happened with Saffron right now is I, could, I think she's having a panic, panic attack or something like that. And so we're trying to figure out what the fuck is going on too. <laughs> what just happened? Okay, so um, I was on a, I was on a video call to this person, to a woman. Uh, her name is Saffron, and then all of a sudden she just started breathing heavily and hyperventilating and saying that she wasn't okay and she was shaking. No, it sounds and... like a panic attack. Can you okay. call Saffron back? Well, no, I, I can't because I've, I've closed the lobby, so now I can't. Sorry. What lobby? Oh, so, no. Uh, so we were on a, on a dating app. So, oh, this is frustrating to explain. We were on a dating app, and then, so I don't know where she lives. We don't have any of the information. I fucked up. I will contact the app's incident center and trace her account. I fucked up. Okay. Her name is Saffron, okay. and she's in the London area. Yeah, 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 Saffron, Saffron. That's it. Yes, 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 London, London. And she was on a video call with you. Your name is? But, uh, Vinny, Vinny. Thank you for your call, Vinny. Oh, we should we should have stayed on the line with her. Fuck, man. Hey, is she all right? Yeah, I uh, I got a message from her on the app, and she she said the ambulance arrived at hers, but she'd recovered from the panic attack by then. Okay. Yeah. Then she just apologized to me loads. I mean, it's understandable. Oh, She's man, she cool, she let man. us know that she does so get panic bad. attacks. Oh, Callum, maybe I should have stayed on the call instead of running. Ah, uh, don't do that, man. Don't do that. You did good, man. You did really good, bro. Well done, man. <sighs> okay. It's just so hard to tell. I just didn't know what to do in that situation. Should I? It's cool, man. Stop it, man. Damn it. No, Look, I, I obviously think... this is something you have to consider whether you can handle or not. Of course. Right, right, um, right, 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 right. I have to be all in. It wouldn't be fair to either of us otherwise. Mm. So how was the date going before that? I have to say that it was going great. Hey. Um, she's into some really different stuff, but I, Callum, I just, I, I love it. And I think that I'll really broaden my horizons with her. Wow. <laughs> I never thought that I would hear those words coming out your mouth, bruv. That's big. Neither did I, but mm. I had a lot to learn from her and hopefully she had something to learn from me, but... I don't know what she's going to learn from you, but yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. No, that's good, man. <laughs> I think you could actually learn a lot from me and uh, you know. Oh, is it? <laughs> <sighs> All right, man. Hey, I'm hitting the sack, man. <laughs> you got some things to do tomorrow and I hope that goes well for you. Yeah, I back myself. Hmm. So what do you need me for? Everything else. <laughs> Everything else in my life. Yes. I need. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Nah, as always, I appreciate you, man. Love, man. Take care, man. Yeah, I shall. Right. Peace. Bye-bye. Okay, so what happened here? So, send one invitation for a third date. Oh, man. I think Saffron... So Maya was honest with us, right? She had, We asked her about the cheating thing. She was honest with us about why she cheated on her ex-boyfriend because he cheated on her and she was trying to get it back. She, she did seem genuinely like upset about her action and she didn't want to be judged about it. She's also extremely young too. She said that they were younger. She does she, – she, she definitely has a bubbly personality. They, they both are very, very fun. Um saffron does deal with the panic attacks um and she you know she does like the spirituality things and all that stuff like that but i feel like it felt like there were sometimes like i was walking on eggshells with saffron a little bit not just because the panic attacks but it felt like she didn't feel like we were as compatible a little bit she got some she got disappointed so i think we're gonna go with maya even though i did i did like saffron I, I really I did I think she was really cool. Uh oh, Maya didn't decline mm -hmm. both. Oh, Maya didn't go go with us, huh? Should we accept it? It'll be a dinner date. Let's fucking go, dude. Decline both. We've got a happy life. Yeah, X. Okay. I'm tr I'm trying to get laid, bro. It's the big dinner tonight, boy. Hey, what's on the menu, man? Uh, well, listen, I've got it all planned out, but I'm not sure what Maya's doing there. What, you guys aren't coordinating? Well, sort of. She said we should, I don't know, surprise each other, so we'll see. Okay, true to form, I guess. So what are you making over there? Okay, so I've decided to go with a paella, because I'm hoping she'll dig the idea that I'm embracing the whole Spanish cuisine and everything, so... Yeah, uh, so, obviously, like... Date three is something. No, it's nothing, man. What? Bro, if this was an in-person date, the third date, you'd have to make things escalate by now, bro. Okay, well, that's off the table, because obviously we're not in person. There's got to be a way to do it, man. Listen, I'll play it by ear, I'll read the vibe, see what happens. Go well, lad. Yeah, do well. Okay, listen, cool. Um, I'm going to go, but we'll debrief later, yeah? Yeah, give us a bell, innit? But, uh, I might not pick up. <laughs> Why? What are you, what are you laughing? Why? What's oh, going on? your boy has only gone and got himself a little video date tonight, haven't I? No! Yeah. Are you serious? <laughs> well, who? When? When? How? What? Whoa, whoa, what? whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, chill, bro. You know I don't like to, you know, talk about these things. Ah, listen, I'm not going to pry. I won't ask any more questions. Yeah, man, stop getting all of my business, man. Uh, why don't you call me this time on a debrief? Uh, cool, bro. Have a good one, yeah? Uh, listen, I'm going to dash. But good luck. You're going to smash it. I know you will. You too, bro. You too. Ah, uh, bye, bye, bye. Mm -hmm. Okay, give me one second here. No stream from that, from that pan. No steam from that pan. Where's the immersion? Hey. Oh, look at that. She cleaned. <laughs> she cl she she cleaned up. No, no. Listen, no, you're good. I wasn't going anywhere. Um, oh, and I have a surprise for you. I hope you like. Oh my God! It's paella. Yeah. <laughs> What do you think? You did a really bad job. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Take. It's a really sweet attempt though. 
What have you got? Why anyway? she, is she crying? Why is she crying? Um, it's a microwave jar, mate. It's a mi <laughs> It's a microwave. It's, I'm okay. I'm quite surprised, if I'm honest. It's not good. No, no, no. Oh my god, it's great. Like I love a chow mein. I'm, now I'm. I should have gone for a chow mein. I don't know why. I'm just sitting here with what looks like okay raw paella. I'm sure um, it's not too bad. Why she's so sad? Is everything all right? Yeah, she looks like she's crying, dude. You... Something seems wrong, Ma. You you okay? Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. You're not fine. Uh, You're crying. Let's just talk about something else, okay? But oh. really? All right. She wants to move Eating on. Eating dinner over the internet. It's so weird, right? I mean, you wouldn't want to eat my paella anyway, so... <laughs> when lockdown is over, I'll take you to the best one in London. Yeah, this is very dry. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, but that would be a great way to graduate digital dating, for sure. Yeah, but it's not been too bad, you know? We've gotten to, like, check out each other's personalities first. You don't always get that. Agreed. Agreed. And each date left me wanting more. Which is there's a second really there's a second game it's called ten dates would, um, hex if you're still to, here to do video dating and it's well, a lot better than this to supposedly yeah I mean, like it's not like dating? through video calls it's like you're actually like, it's hard in to a even imagine dinner life, setting right? like but at a like... restaurant and it like moves around I think I will you know um, it's been a good step before meeting someone I've enjoyed that it's like a vibe check yes exactly exactly that so. That means that um, you pass the vibe. You will be seeing other girls. We're at this conversation. Well, I mean, I think it's important for us both to be on the same page, right? Well, I wasn't planning to. Uh, you're the only girl I'm talking to at the moment. Is that the truth? I mean, this app's made sure of it, so. Oh right, yeah. Uh, okay. No, no, no. I'm joking. <laughs> I. There are so many good reasons that I'm only talking to you, and I hope that continues. You're quite loyal, huh? Guilty. Hmm. So does that mean you want to be in like a relationship, though? I mean, I suppose that's what would happen if we, we kept speaking to each other, no? I personally just feel like I don't want to use labels. Not anymore. I mean, we can be together and like we enjoy each other's company, but the names thing, I'm just, I'm not into it. Yeah. Okay, so I can't, I can't, I can't be a hypocrite here because when Katie and I got together, I technically didn't ask her out or like said to be my girlfriend. It was just like, we were, we were in such a good connection and we started dating and it just, we just, it was it. Because I had I had told her from the very get go I was like once I'm into somebody or if I'm dating somebody it's just you and that's it and um, yeah there was never any like moment where I was like oh you want to be my girlfriend it was just like bam then we're in a relationship kind of thing so I kind of get where she's coming from but the way she but the way she says it the way she says it does make it seem a little bit fishy. But uh, I don't know. I'm summit. I I agree. I agree. And listen, I'm happy to go with the flow. Really? Sounds like she has. She Whatever likes options. Makes most comfortable. Maybe. Yeah. Seriously. Thank you so much. You know, I really was worried about how you react to that. I want to know why she's crying. You were. Yes. Yeah, some guys are like, listen, you're mine, or that's it. And I just hate that. You're not property. I don't own you. If you know, we're individuals, and we hang out, and that's. Yeah, I'm happy. Thank you, Vinny. So, do you think that when we meet in person, the physical attraction will change things? I think we'll probably. I think it would be a massive bonus. Take, right, it take would off be better, our, no? Take off yeah, our clothes and start be. making babies. Okay, so in that case, we've had our first date. How would you end it? <sighs> How would I leave things? Bro, let's go, dude, back to my place. Yeah. How would you leave it? How would you leave things? She's trying to get. She's trying to get there. Yeah. If I sense things are going well, then I'll probably lean in for a kiss. During the first date. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh this is a hypothetical situation. 
Yeah, probably. Okay, then... If you're lucky, I'd ask you back to mine. <laughs> what, what would you say to that, if I asked? If there was a spark and I felt safe, then... Um, yeah, I think I'd go with you. Bruh, let's go. Okay, good to know. That's it's it, dude. We're in, bro. Okay. We're in. Forget everything else. No, I think we're good, Hex. Do you want to kiss me right now? Yeah, dude. Kiss the screen. Hiss. As in if there was kiss, no kiss the screen between us. Kiss the screen. Kiss the screen, Vinny. Mm, kiss the screen. Kiss the screen. I mean, I'm dying too. Yeah. Correct answer. Dang, dude. She's getting hella okay. like. <laughs> We just stopped, so. Dang, okay, dude, she's yeah, getting yeah, hot and stopped. heavy, bro. Did Let's I? go. No, I think did you I? did. I? No, I think you definitely did. I think you know you didn't. Okay, okay, moving on. So, how's your chow mein? It was good. It was good, yeah. <laughs> it's actually my favorite thing about England. <laughs> it's actually Chinese chow mein. Ma, you there? Yes, sorry. Sorry. Bro, what the My fuck is going is... on with this bitch? I guess you noticed that I was obviously crying earlier, right? Obviously. Sort of. Yeah, I mean, my ex, he messaged me, so... Yeah, I knew that. Figured. Oh, okay. Yeah, so what do you say? Well, you're, still, you're still friends, right? Well, it wasn't like a friend's text, you know? Got it, got it. Got it. Oh, yeah, I understand. So, where do you think your head's at? I'm just so confused because, like, well, we have something I've put in my past and I don't want to ever go back there. But, like, it's hard to just kill the feelings, right? We it's we spend so much time together. I'm worried that there's a part of me that will always have love for him. I mean, there's always a part that, like... Say something. There's always... Meaning. Uh, the confidence. I think the I'm not ang getting angry at her is not uh is not the not the not the way to go. I would go understanding her confidence here because it's like when you're with somebody for a long time, there's always that piece of you that wishes them well, unless they like were a piece of shit and like you know abused you. And even then, you have people that were like can't let go of somebody because of love and shit like that. I'm gonna go with confidence. I'm gonna okay, see look, my I get it. Um. You know, most of your adult life and relationship experience has been with this prick. He's not a prick, man. He's he's a good guy. I'm sure he is. He cheated on he cheated on her. I just think that I'll be better to you in every single way. And I can promise you that. That's hey. quite cocky. No, nah, bro, that's confidence, bro. No, it's not cocky. I just listen, I believe in myself and what I have to offer. So the next step, moving off this app. I mean, what happens? Do we do we get each other's numbers? I guess so. I mean, I need to think about what's going on in my mind, and you need to do sure. the same. I could end I it right here. That. I yeah, could end it. Ah, dude, we're going, we're going in it, dude. We're getting this. Right. We're getting the happy ending right here, dude. Happy. happy. I think we've got something good here. So let's see how much more there is. Come on, you alcoholic. Let's fucking go, bro. Oh my god, this is so much nicer than the app. Let's I'm go, not, dude. Oh, wait, you're right. Winner. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. I'm cozy. Cozy. That we'd end up in bed together after the first end day. Oh, yeah, no, I did. It's Jiao Main. Jiao Main is, is the way to my heart. And? Yes, and the red wine. It helps me sleep, okay? Also, it gives me the craziest dreams. You ever get that? A dream I actually had recently, this is really funny. A dream I had recently is that I met a really amazing girl on this new dating app. <laughs> oh my God. Go on, okay, tell, tell me about a dream you had. I had this dream the other night that like, I was like in a movie and I was like, but at the same time I was shooting the movie. So I was like doing both at the same time. And then it was like everyone, yeah, like, but like I couldn't Oh she just she just keeps going. It was a it was a pretty good game, I I, I guess. It was pretty quick. Um 
I think it was about an hour and a half of the game, I want to say. But, but just about an hour and a half. And, and that's, this is just the first playthrough. You could easily, easily go through, through the game again. Um, I'm, I'm interested in seeing the second game. Are, are you going to be hanging out, Hex? Are you going to be taking off? Because I, I heard this, the first game is is like in this uh, FaceTime mode, but the second game is like actual, like, sit more cinematic or anything like that. So yeah, that's cool. It'd be it be nice to to do to uh to uh to play along third day with Maya was a success. So we had once one successful dates one out of five dates failed two choices made 170 scenes viewed. there's 766 scenes bro what the fuck